This is SA Live and the Western Heritage Parade and Cattle Drive. Brought to you by Complete Care. It's happening. Oh, yes, the streets are back. The Longhorns are about to get unloaded. So let's rodeo, San Antonio. You guys ready for Woo! the party? Yes, ready. Look at this all around us. Hey, welcome to SA Live's extreme SA Live rodeo yes. parade coverage of the Cattle Drive and the Western Heritage Parade and Festival. I'm Jeff Roper. And Fiona Gorsese and I are glad that you're here today because we're in the middle of Houston Street. Yeah, this is our first ever SA Live Cattle Drive Special brought to you by Complete Care. And you know what? Let's take a look at our cattle cam because okay. this is cool. Th there will be a huge traffic jam because the Longhorns are being released onto Houston Street from under the I-35 intersection there. Just down below us, there are over 80 head of Longhorn cattle, which will be headed our way, which this is the official kickoff of the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. And what's happening today on KSAT 12 is a first. This is the first time this event has ever been broadcast. And as we continue to, uh, you know, pack the streets and watch, we've got a live picture of all the cattle that are, that are headed this way. And uh, one of the original cattle that was a part of that uh, is still in the parade today. Oh uh, yeah, and there of course are horses, you're gonna see sheep, the Palomino Patrol is going to make an appearance as well, and there are gonna be some babies that you'll see that everyone always coos about. And uh, you wanna keep your eye out, of course, you can see the right, right there on the bottom. Uh, side of your screen because right that will be up the whole time. That's so that our cattle, cattle cam. cam and by the way, I'd like to take this opportunity to tell someone that we should have made that like the Vision Works cattle <laughs> cam. I mean, we should have sold that to somebody, that, you know, that could have put a sponsorship on that bad boy down there because the cattle cam is on. It'll be on the TV the whole time. This is so cool. And uh, I can't wait for you guys to see it live. We have so many cameras and so many things for you to see. The crowd that's down here and uh, they're going to be headed toward Alamo Plaza, Fiona, which is, you know, just, just down the street of the Emily Morgan. I don't know if you can get a shot of that, right? But but down there, they'll be celebrating. Oh, yeah. Chuck wagons, kids' activities, music, food, and fun. And you can also check it out after the parade. The party is going to keep going until 1 o'clock. And, and we want to take a look at everyone lined up under I-35. There are historical wagons. Ropers, there it is. Miss Rodeo is there. Sheepdogs. Yeah, Nikki Woodward is, is going to be joining us here in just a little bit. And there's so much, so much that we don't know what will happen. Yeah. The best part about this parade coverage on KSAT 12 is we're doing it SA Live style. Oh, for those yeah. Of you, for those of you that are working during the, the middle of the day, <laughs> uh, Fiona and I do a, a talk show at 1 o'clock every day called SA Live. And thanks to you, it's the number one lifestyle fun variety show on San Antonio television. And, and we do things a little differently. We do things a little off the chain. Yes. So we're to doing say the, the least. we're doing this parade the way we want to do this parade. <laughs> That's right. Which means anything can happen. <laughs> anything can happen, and we've got all sorts of stuff around. If you want to take a look right there, if you look in front of us, you can see our photographer John is up in the bucket to get okay, a great I'll, I'll, bird's eye can view. I, can I show you this? Yeah, look John. This. There's John. John is a new addition to our staff, so we voted him into the bucket. He is about four stories up, and he will have the best view of the parade. John, there's your camera. You'll be able to see everything as it happens. And uh, we couldn't afford a drone, so we put John in a in a cherry picker. <laughs> I love this because John's up there, and John uh, had a has had a great week preparing for this. John, <laughs> do you have a parachute? Are you okay? No parachute. Yes. <laughs> okay. Y'all give it up for John. Yay! He's doing a great job. And of course, for the crowd here, we've got our producer, Jen, standing by with prizes to Jen, give away. Jen Strusky and I are going to be riding the microphone a little bit, so we got prizes. Are you ready for this? Oh, yeah. We got a ton of people over here that want to play games with us. Yeah. People are really and then, wait, and here's Katie, our other producer. She's over here. We're going to line up some stuff along along with Veronica. And then uh, we've got other people. we got our camera guys in the street. Can we get a shot of Ted over here? Just Ted, Ted, meet Kai. Kai, meet Ted. You guys flip back and forth between each other. There they are. They, these two people will be following us all over the place. So, so many people have worked hard to make this a great event. But, you know, the biggest, the biggest group of people that make the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo what it is are the volunteers, over 7,000 of them, and 
so many volunteers on this committee just to kick things off here in the middle of downtown San Antonio today. And oh, yeah. as we, I'm looking behind us to make sure there are no Longhorns coming. <laughs> I think we got some time. I think we got some time, but I think we, okay. we can split up and cover some ground. Well, I'm watching the cattle cam on the bottom of the screen, which, by the way, is sponsorable. Uh, if, you, if, you, if you'd like to sponsor it, call us now. I'll give you a free mention on live national San Antonio television. <laughs> All right, so uh, we have some other people that we need to talk to. I'm going to go over this way yeah. and introduce you to the head man at the San Antonio Rodeo. And why don't you, you go that yeah, way and find the other yes. guy. Okay, so okay. you follow me. You go that way. Come with me over here. I want to introduce you to Keith Martin. He is the executive. Executive Director and CEO of the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo, sir. Hi, Jeff. How are you? It is a pleasure to see you here. Good to I know see you've you. been sleeping at the Buckhorn all night preparing for I this have, event. I have. And this is a truly uh, one of a kind. It is. And, and we, we love it. It is so much fun to kick off the rodeo this way. And we obviously, I just gave a shout out to all the volunteers and, and all the people that do so many great things. And how does it feel to have the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo win large indoor rodeo of the year for the 11th straight year, Key? It, it's wonderful. You know, our volunteers work very hard all year long, and they get the credit for that. And it means a lot to them. And somebody said, well, gosh, isn't it, don't you get tired of that? And I said, absolutely not. Because it happens to be what our core values are about, integrity, caring and excellence. They want to be the best, they care a lot, and they do it with integrity. So that's perfect. And you give so much back to the community. Would you consider that to be part of the success, the reason you do the rodeo? Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, <clears throat> the rodeo uh, and all uh, of the stuff that surrounds it helps us to educate the kids of Texas, and that's what we're all about. Last That's night why the volunteers are there. So how yeah. much much? $12 million? So $12.2 million. Yeah, that's un un yeah. Un unbelievable yeah. in scholarships. And last night on our special, we introduced you to one of those young women who's, yeah. who's made her life what it is, thanks to the San Antonio Aren't Stock Show. It, 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 it is wonderful to see what happens. And yeah. what are you most excited about, seeing Pitbull? <laughs> No, you know what? After after 47 years, I still get excited about watching the rodeo. I know. And all of the people that come on the grounds. I got to tell you, it's different every year. Uh, we have families and all types of folks that come to see the rodeo. You need to go wonderful. every year to discover something yeah. new. Or and I enjoy that still. Well, to this thanks day. for letting us do this today. Thank you, Jeff. This Thank is a first for, for everybody for KSAT. here. Wow. Oh, well, KSAT believes in the community, and Fiona's got another special guest. Oh, uh, yes, I'm here with Cody Dav Davenport, San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo President. Are you having a good time? I'm having a great time. Isn't this crowd great? <laughs> it's unbelievable to watch how this thing is growing. The weather's perfect. I mean, you could not ask for a better day. There we go. Now they're waking up behind us. Hey, wave, you're on TV. Me right now. <laughs> All right, so what are you excited about the rodeo this year? What's new? Well, uh, actually, I've got a little list here of new things I'd like to read. Uh, there's, some, there's some neat stuff happening this year. You know, we talk about, um, we always talk about we're, we're beyond cows and plows. That's our base. That's where we come from. We never forget that. But there's a lot of new things coming on uh, engineering oriented. We've got the Lego Fest coming out this year. We have a uh, agrobotics con competition going on with 4-H. Um, we've got an H2O big fishing exhibit. Bring kids in there and let them fish live. It's a catch and release deal, but get kids into the sport of fishing and, and seeing what all's out there in that. Um, our ag mech, our ag mechanics program is expanding. Um, we actually are going to have a trade show involved in it this year. The entries are exploding on us. Um, the world of agriculture, engineering, and those aspects of it are, are critical to the success of agriculture and where it's going. So we're really reaching out in all that, and I think you're going to see a lot of new programs in that area that are expanding this year and coming out. And we're, we're excited about that. And you speak about reaching out, and of course, it helps give back to the community. Who benefits from all the money raised by the San Antonio well, Sancho Rodeo? The youth of Texas as Absolutely. a whole. I mean, that's, that's what we're all about, uh, education and the youth of Texas which ultimately helps us because those are our future leaders. They're the ones taking over for us, right? they got to take care of us. We're giving them a chance to get out there and, and get a good start on their lives with education. And that's what we're all about. That's what the, the 6,000 volunteers that are dedicated to it, that's what they're there for. That's the cause behind every move that we, we uh, make. And we all firmly believe in it. We're committed to it. And of course, the entertainment lineup. A lot of people are excited. I'm excited to see Gary, Gary Allen. I think. Are you, are you excited to see Becky G? Maybe. No. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad she's there. <laughs> but, uh, All right. All right. I, I, I don't know. Somebody, somebody get him out of here. Somebody get him out of here. Somebody remove him. Somebody remove him.
remove him. Wait a minute. No, 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 no. Cody, I know Cody. Cody's excited about seeing Chris Stapleton at Extreme Bulls, and there's always something new at the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. Jen Tobias Trusky is here with me. Look at the cool stuff that we're fixing to give away. More than an eight-second ride. We got free stuff. We're doing the big cattle drive shirts. And let's see who can ride the microphone for eight seconds. Do we have anybody who wants to play? Woo! Would you like to play, ma'am? You want to be on live national San Antonio television? Oh, I love it. That, yes. that is great. And who is this? This is my husband. Some guy she just picked up. Some dude. <laughs> Some guy she found on the street. What's your name? Brennan. Brennan, and you are? April. All right, April, I'm going to put you on the mic for eight seconds here. Okay. okay, so we'll put eight seconds up on the clock. In eight seconds, I want you to name for me, <laughs> I want you to name for me three animals you would see at the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. Oh, I think I can do that. Are you ready? <laughs> Go! Um, horses and um, cattle. Eight seconds. Oh. Um, and um, dogs. D and dogs. Cattle. Cattle dogs. What? Cattle dogs. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Was that three? I think she stayed on. All right, we're, we're going to give you that. It's harder than it looks, isn't it? A bull. Yeah, yeah, a bull, a bull. Let's go ahead and hook her up. Here's okay. a T-shirt and a hat. Who else wants to play? Somebody else want to play? All right, let's walk. We walk down, walk walk this way. Are you guys, are you guys from San Antonio? Yes, we are. Really? And we've got some other folks in here from Colombia. Colombia. You think you can ride the mic for eight seconds? I sure can. Okay, eight seconds. What's your name? Rita Calmar. Rita, eight seconds up on the clock. I want you to do for me three sounds that you would hear at the rodeo. Go. Move. No, do it like it. Do it like it. <laughs> 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 okay, we'll, we'll give her a prize. She was on the clock for eight seconds. And the cattle cam continues at the bottom of the screen. Let's go find another little person to play. Hi. What is your name? Sophia. Hi, Sophia. Who are you here with? My mom and my is that, dad. Is that your sister or your mommy? <laughs> my mom. Where is that your mom right there? Okay, you want to be on TV? You have a boy. You have a boyfriend? No. Good. <laughs> Stay away from boys. They're nothing but trouble. Do you think you can play a game with me right now? I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you ride the microphone, okay? Okay. That means in eight seconds, I want you to name something for me, okay? Can you name for me three foods that you would eat at the rodeo when you go out there? Can you name three foods? Ready? Go! Uh, funnel cake. Yeah. Turkey legs. Turkey legs. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. We'll give it to her. Yeah, she's in there. All right. We're going to give you a prize, all right? Let's go find Fiona and find out what, what else is going on. Oh look! We're, it's coming, so we're oh, it's coming. That means we need to get out of the road. Yeah. Is that what needs to happen? Take a commercial break. Do we need to take a break now? Yeah. Do we need to take a break? Yes. Yeah. yeah we yeah. do need to take a break because watch the cattle cam and the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeos Western Heritage Festival Parade and Cattle Drive is coming, and we got to get out of the way. Yes. Yeah. We need to move. All right. We got to. Oh, we should. Oh. Oh, I can put her in that now. Oh, come over here. I want to put. I want to show you something. I got. A special place for us to watch the parade. Really? Come on over. I, I got. I rented this thing last night, and we're gonna make us walk around the planet to get there. I gotta get in over here. Come, come on, Fiona. Hurry. Excuse us. Pardon us. Get out of the way. Come on. Come on. Get it. here. We go. These people. We got. Here you go. Look. You're supposed to get up in here. What? Yeah. I got a place for you to watch the parade from, Fiona. Yeah, you better. Uh, I don't know. Please stay on the ground. Are we on TV still? Okay, because because this is. All right, we're gonna get out of the way. Well, I'll stay down here if you want. I'll run with the. Good night. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna get out of the way because the cattle are coming. You feel safe up here? Oh, yeah. Is it pretty good? How high do we want to go? How, can, how high can we go? High enough. All right, we're going up. We're going up, and then we'll come back, and we'll show you what happens on, on, the, on the ground from Houston Street. I wish you could see our view. We're going to go up here with our camera guy, John, and bring, John. You, bring you the parade like you've, like you've never seen it before. Is John up there? Which yeah. camera are we on? Hey, how are y'all? Good to see you. Yeah. All right, are we taking a break now? Yeah, all right, we're coming back on KSAT 12.
Hey, welcome back to KSET 12 and SA Live's coverage of the Western Heritage Festival Parade and Cattle Drive with the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. And we, I'm going to take us up a little higher. Let's do it. This is how you get closer <laughs> to the Longhorns. That'll take this button right here. Here we go. Let's go. There we go. We're going to go up a little higher. Ted. Hold on, buddy. I'm going to get you as close to the Longhorn as I possibly can <laughs> on the side of the Buckhorn. Look at that bad boy right there. You know what? We see this every day when we do our show here. And I don't know if you can, I don't know if you can see our bucket truck. We're going to bring you an aerial view. Can we, can we swing this around and show you, John? Okay. So we have a view of the cattle that are coming down Houston. Yep. They're coming down right now. You can see them. And of course, this is the first ever SA Live cattle drive. And of course, we are doing it our way. You saw John up there in the bucket. We were giving out prizes early. And the third Longhorns and Kimball Longhorns are coming down the street. I want you to notice the, the gentlemen that are in the middle of the road are very brave. These are our dignitaries, General Perry Wiggins. And uh, we've got the, the president of the rodeo, the executive director of the rodeo. As as they get their picture made, and we, <laughs> they're going to need to move. Look at them turn around and look. It's like, whoa. Yeah. As they bring eight. Oh, yeah, we've got 80 head of Longhorn steer. This right Right here is a traffic issue. <laughs> 20 calves too, so you're going to see the babies as well coming down Houston Street. And this year marks the largest group of purebred Texas Longhorns for a cattle drive. Yeah, these these animals. Uh, one of them is from the original cattle drive, which occurred nine years ago. Kikio is in the mix, and this is this is the largest group that they've ever had. And as you see, these animals they really cannot tell where they're horns are. They're like giant curb feelers. <laughs> um, Look, they're the babies. And the streets of San Antonio have been blocked off. Unlike the running of the bulls in Spain, these animals are just taking this at a very slow pace. You you and I had an opportunity to ride these, one of the, uh, the longhorns the other day. Oh, yes. And yes, I'm, we did. And, and uh, there are some coming that you'll be able to ride here in a second. These steer that are there being ridden. I'm going to stop them and ask if we can ride again. Would you be up for that? Yeah, no. I'm okay. We, we'll come down after we get, get the longhorns. They're driving these up to the Alamo. And we want to thank Hope Thurman and, and her crowd. Because nine years ago, they called and go, would you like to do a cattle drive? <laughs> yes, this is the ninth year. And, of course, the party continues in Alamo Plaza till 1 o'clock. Lots of stuff to do for the families and the kids. I don't know if you can see it from the backside as they walk down the, uh, the rest of Houston Street. We've got a shot from our bucket. And they are certainly beautiful animals. Oh, yeah. So we are ready to rodeo San Antonio. Hey, look, look down here. That's Kicks Brooks. He's riding, he's riding in the parade. Look at that mustache. <laughs> that fella right there, we got famous people. Uh, doing the boot scooting boogie. Now the ride of hey, you think you could take us down so we can hop aboard a longhorn? We're gonna go down. Because I've, I've asked Russell, my buddy, just take us on down. We're going to stop yeah. this parade. The way we do, we do this. <laughs> yeah, Russell's bringing one. He's the one. That's the fastest Longhorn in, in Texas. I'm going to stop him and see if we can get on. All right. Would you be up for riding again? Yeah, let's do it. All right. We're getting out. And we're going to continue to bring you coverage of this on KSAT 12. But, hey, Russell. Stop. I need a ride. Here you go. <laughs> yes. And I've lost everything. Okay. Uh, I'll get it for you. It's all right. Thank you much. Come on out. Okay, just Hi. hang on to it. Excuse us. Hang on to my phone. Good God. Not part of the plan. Go <laughs> there. Hey, what's up? How are you? It's good to see you. Now look, need... this is where. This is how. Hey, Russell. Russell, baby, up, I want to get on. I, you know, you here about this animal. This casino in Vegas. This casino in Vegas. This is Vegas. He's the fastest longhorn in the whole state. Of now, Texas. when you say that, how fast does that mean he will go? Well, twelve. Not, well, let's 15, say maybe fifty miles an hour. Fifty miles. Can we give it a whirl? Would you well, mind if we if we took another ride? Jump up there. Let's which, go. Which one should Fiona ride? Let's put her <laughs> in the casino. No, Can I'm you hop right on shoes. casino? I'm going <laughs> to okay. give you give you this. Okay. That's right, yours. Oh, and is so th this one here is this is me. This is the one that you don't want to be on. You want to be on that. I want to be. This yeah, is the this, fast one. All right. This, I, all right I'm gonna give you that microphone, okay? And I'm gonna hop up here. Here we go. 
Really? And you can ride these animals. They are so beautiful. And it's, it's just like it's just like driving. Hey, man, I want to I see you here. So we're on TV right now. And this animal is this animal is how old, Russell? He's seven years old. Seven years old, and he is. The, this is this is the fastest Longhorn in the state of Texas. Okay. All right. And all you gotta do is give him a little a little tap. He he responds hey. really well. I wish you could see how easy this. Now, Russell, I'm gonna make a U-turn. All right. Okay. So we're gonna go this way. Come on. Come on. Let's do it. We we're doing donuts. We're doing donuts. Look out, Kai. Look out. Come on. Oh, there we go. Now that right there is a donut in the middle in the middle of Houston, middle of Houston Street. Oh, okay, I think God. that one follows this one. So we, yeah, well we can't really go that way. There's horses. So we we keep the parade going a little bit. Let's go. Okay, Come I'll on, follow casino. you. Come on, casino. There we go. There we, oh, hey, look out now. This is how this works. Here we go. Come on. Come All on. Right. So John up in the bucket truck. We'll be right back with more after this. We are cruising out Houston Street. Yes, welcome back to the SA Live Cattle Drive. Of course, the Western Heritage Parade underway, and you're looking at the Texas Hill Country Stock Dog Association. We've got the sheep dogs the hard at work. The, yeah, the dog association. And these animals are amazing. They just had the uh, herd of sheep do a do a U-turn for us, and they're being followed by some really important people. The John Jay Student Council. Ted, I don't know if you get a shot of them, but they are they are scooping the the uh, the remnants. And of course, we have. Uh, our color guard that is here, the Laredo Sector Customs and Border Protection Honor Guard, providing us with our colors today, and they've been at many national events across the country, including the Dallas Cowboys, the Spurs, the Mardi Gras parade. And representing Oak Crest is the peer mediation team. These are outstanding individuals. And they are are uh, they are showing off the San Antonio livestock sales banner. Hi guys. Hi you guys. We're glad you guys are here today. Oh, uh, here we go. Look at these beautiful flags. Jack Sellers, Bear County Palomino Patrol and Trill Team. Mr. Jack Sellers founded the Jack Sellers Bear County Palomino Patrol in 1951. Formed a ride specifically with the Jack Sellers Bear County Palomino Patrol in the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. They have opened every rodeo night since 2003. They are, are certainly prestigious and the majesty of what they provide. And of course, when you're backstage at the rodeo under the AT&T Center, to see them line up and get ready ready to go. That's one of my favorite parts. Hello, sir. That's one of the, my favorite parts of the rodeos when you go when they sing the national anthem and then just the, the kickoff every night with all the lasers and the flags. It really make helps set the tone. Yes. It really does. These are beautiful animals, too. They're, of course, featured in our rodeos. Just last night. You are watching live coverage of the 2016 cattle drive headed to the Alamo for the Western Heritage Parade and Festival, which is the official kickoff of the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. I'm Jeff Roper along with Fiona Gorstiza and our SA Live crew because we're live from the Buckhorn Saloon every day right here on Houston Street. We just pulled our cameras outside because of the, the, the great view that we have every day and we said we ought to put this on television. All right, we are right in the middle of it. Coming up next, we have the wagon with West San Antonio is home of the nation's newest World Heritage Site, the San Antonio Missions, and they are bringing their flag and wagon. You can enjoy these historic treasures through tours, attending a service, exploring the museums, or hiking and biking the river walks and Mission Range. Now, I think later on in the parade, we're going to see some miniature mules, but I think I think the daddy's here is a donkey. <laughs> <laughs> so when I say, let me see that donkey, donkey. Donkey, let me see that donkey, donkey. <laughs> <laughs> 
So uh, there are no rubber tires in this event, and everything here is a throwback to the 18 to 1900s. And Alex Pena is here, and he's going to tell us what is coming up next in the parade. This is uh, one of our fallen uh, committee members, Bob Lou, the constable for Precinct Three, first Chinese uh, that was ever elected in the state of Texas. And we're doing a tribute to him now. And there is his horse, his horse with and no rider. And no rider. And a tribute to him. And a tribute to him. Very special. All right, we're coming back on KSAT 12 with more of our parade coverage from Houston Street. Wait till you see what happens next. This is SA Live and the Western Heritage Parade and Cattle Drive, brought to you by Complete Care. Welcome back. You're in the middle of the Western Heritage Parade here on Houston Street as part of our first ever SA Live Cattle Drive special. Yeah, the million dollar band from Indian Land. They are getting it done. We're fixing to leave a mark on Houston Street. And one of the great things is there's one band invited to this parade every year, and uh, Raul Escobar is the director, and he is Yes, sir, how you doing? You're proud of these kids, aren't you? Yes, sir, good kids, good hardworking kids. We're really proud to be a part of the community, for sure. They just played the horse, and now we're doing a little... The chop, we're actually going to finish with the horse as we march through here in a second, so yeah. Very good. Yeah. How many members? Um, with uh, usually about 150, we only have the band and the percussion here today. Our color guard has a contest uh, in New Braunfels this afternoon, so they're not here with us. Oh, very good. Yeah. And so do you have a fundraiser coming up we can promote? Nothing yet, nothing okay, yet. but uh, you, you guys love to travel, and so yes, we'll, sir. We'll, we'll look for you. Harlandale uh, High School. Thank you, thank you. And the Million Dollar Band. Yes, sir. That's great. Good to see you. Your thank band, you. Your band may have left you. I, I think, yep, that's all right. We'll catch up. <laughs> They sound great. Congratulations. Thank you. Heritage Riders. Coming up next, the Texas Heritage Riders coming down Houston Street here by the Buckhorn. Their mission, of course, is to promote and preserve the heritage of our Western lifestyle and the impact horses have made the way we live. Yeah, the band's still on the TV there, and we just want you to know that they are a number one rated band. We got people in the hey, street. Hey, okay. People wanting, people wanting selfies in the street. This is out of control. Hey, hey, hi. Hi. It's yes, hello. Hi. We got the band boosters here, too. I know you I'm at work. The Texas hair. The Texas Heritage Riders are next, and I wish I could tell you how cool this is because we're just kind of hanging out with our friends today for a San Antonio tradition. Yeah. This is so awesome. And we've got a lot of the VIPs from the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo here. And their They're families. partying right across the we're street. We're having a parking lot party. And then we've got these folks over here that are, where Where are you from? San Antonio. San Antonio. And is this your first time down here? Oh, no, sir. You come every year, yes, don't sir. you? This is like uh, Fiesta with livestock, isn't it? Yes, sir. That's exactly how it works. What's your your name? Ethan. Ethan, what's your favorite part about the parade? The band. The band. The band was great, wasn't it? They played the horse. Da, 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 da. It's really cool, huh? Yes. Let me see if I can get your prize too, okay? Okay. All right, great. These horses were really cool too, weren't they? What'd you What'd you think of those Longhorns? I liked them. They were out of control, weren't they? Makes you want to. All the way from Romania. You're from Romania. All the way from Romania. We came here especially to see this. Well, thank yes. you very much. Welcome That's to San Antonio. That's very wonderful. Thank you should, you, so you much. should hang out. It's a great place to live. Thank you. Thank okay, you. what's well, wonderful? He's from Romania. Wow. Yeah, I mean. Get, get him a T-shirt too, okay? And then uh, we we do have the the riders here, and of course, you know, at the end of this parade, San Antonio Sanitation will be sweeping the street. <laughs> I know you thought it was gonna be Santa Claus, but no, that parade happened a while a while, a while yes. back. And coming up, we'll introduce you to to Miss Rodeo Texas. We're gonna stop and talk to Nikki Woodward. Okay. Uh, she's a she's a new winner. Do we need to take a break now? Okay, okay we're coming back, but you guys stick around. We're going to show you some really cool stuff from high above Houston Street in front of the Buckhorn Saloon on KSAT 12. Thank you. Thank you. This is stopped. Yeah, they But next is going to be Miss Rodeo. Welcome back to the SA Live Cattle Drive Special. 
Western Heritage Parade, of course, underway here on Houston Street. There's Nikki Woodward. She is Miss Rodeo Texas. And hi, Nikki. How are you? Good. I'm doing great. How are y'all doing? How's the weather up there? It's a little bit colder up here. You know, I'm getting to work out with my hands. They're a little cold, but we're doing great. What's the name of your horse? This is Jazz, and he loves the parade. He knows his job, and uh, he, he's working the crowd for sure. So this is your first cattle drive with the yes. San Antonio Rodeo, and of course, Miss Rodeo Texas. We saw you at the Alamo the other day, kicking yes, things off. There. What are you most excited about about this year's rodeo? Obviously, you're a part of the program every night. Yes, sir. I sure am. I'm in the arena carrying flags and in and out there all the time, but I'm really excited about getting some of the community to come out and just meeting them. I've had so many people approach me throughout my Ryan saying, hey, we're going to be at the San Antonio Rodeo. We're going to come specifically and find you. And I'm excited to see everybody who's told me about that and just experience the rodeo from start to finish. Well, thanks for being here today. Congratulations. Yes, and you. we'll see you there, all right? Yes, sir. Don't all right. too hard. Miss, I will not do it. But look, she's even got the Alamo on her chaps there. Look at there. <laughs> she is Miss Rodeo Texas. We're going to ask you to keep going, okay, so we can right. get more of the parade in there and wave everybody in. Hi, how are you? Miss Rodeo Texas team, Sissy Wynn, also going by. And both those ladies skilled in horsemanship and, of course, loving the lifestyle that is presented and represented here with the Western Heritage Festival Parade and Cattle Drive. All of this culminating in Alamo Plaza. And then Laredo Patrol is here. Their horse patrol unit is established in 2010 with 25 adopted Mustang horses in the unit. They're credited with more than 12,000 apprehensions, hundreds of pounds and drug seizures, and dozens of rescues. They were featured in the National Youth Graphics and normally when you see them approaching at a gallop, that means you probably shouldn't be here. Uh, can we see some identification? <laughs> One of the only two military honors caissons in the country is here in the parade today. And they are joining us from Fort Sam Houston. And it's a big part of the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo's cattle drive. Look at these beautiful animals. Riders are Staff Sergeant Darren Thomas, Staff Sergeant Brandon Hood, Sergeant Seth Whitley, Sergeant Travis Bay, Sergeant Lehman Wright, First Lieutenant Jeremy Boykendall from San Antonio, Staff Sergeant Edward Montgomery and Mr. John Dealey, Staple Master. And of course, this is the one of two in the country, these, these caissons from Fort Sam Houston and a ceremonial unit dedicated to soldiers who have sacrificed their lives in serving their country. Hi, how are you? Thank you for your service. We're glad you're here. The Rough Riders Drill Team are coming down Houston Street. Yeah, well, you know, Teddy called, and he's been looking for some Rough Riders. You know, we hang out in the Buckhorn Saloon on a daily basis here. Making from the, the way over from, from the Minger. From the Minger <laughs> and the Bullet Holes to the Buckhorn, where we do our show every day. And, in fact, there's a Teddy in the back in the Buckhorn Museum. There. But, uh, yeah, the Rough Rider Drill Team is here. They perform in more than 40 pro rodeos every year, and they are all comprised of families. There are husband and wife, father and daughter, and mother and daughter teams. They were founded 10 years ago by Colleen Dyer. She still serves as coach. And of course, they're sporting the beautiful red, white, and blue of the Texas flag and the pride that goes with. Look at all the equipment that these animals have. They're just beautiful. There are over 200 animals in today's parade. 80 longhorn steers, which we witnessed at the beginning, were the ones that kicked it all off, and that's the most that's ever been in a cattle drive in downtown San Antonio. And the funnest bunch of cowgirls on the planet, the 40-something cowgirls making their way down Houston Street. They started as a way for women around the age of 40 to get back in the saddle. All different riding levels and experience. They've all become great friends, and they give back through the American Cancer Society, Wounded Warriors, and various children's hey, hospitals. Hey, why are you the funnest bunch of cowgirls? Because we love to ride horses and enjoy good company. Yes, good company. It's a party all the time with four legs. All right, we're coming back on SA Live and KSAT 12. A 
small cold or a major injury, the folks at Complete Care want to make sure you get treated as quickly as possible without all that hassle of waiting. And Gabe Mendoza, Director of Nursing, is here to tell us more about what they offer. Hey Hi. there. Hi. Hey, what's great about you guys is you guys are all over town. Right, right. We have five locations here in San Antonio. Um, so we're really throughout all of San Antonio from the south side to the east side, the west side, and the north side as well. So it's kind of nice that we're conveniently located across San Antonio. Now, what types of medical issues do you cover there? Well, the nice thing is we have an ER physician on site 24 7, so oh, we can cover nice. any medical condition that comes in the door. Um, we can do anything from a minor emergency, sore throats, lacerations, broken bones, abdominal pain, fever, to the major things like a heart attack, chest pain, difficulty breathing. Um, we're able to provide services for pediatrics and adults just the same. Now, I know a lot of folks may have visited an urgent care. Right. What makes you guys different? Well, several factors. The first and foremost is that we're a freestanding emergency room. Um, and again, I said that earlier, we do have a physician on site, so you do see a doctor, an ER physician. Um, and we also have a lot of services that we provide that are different from the urgent care. Uh, we can treat major emergencies. We can treat trauma. We can treat um, adults and pediatrics. It's the same. Uh, the other thing is we have CT scans available. We have all our labs in-house, so everything's done at the facility. There's no send-outs. We're open 24-7. You don't have to make an appointment. We're open, uh, you know, all year long as well. And because you kind of have everything there, right. is that what cuts back on the wait time? Because I know if I'm going to an urgent right. care or an ER, sure. that's what I'm not looking forward to. Right. No, it's huge. The wait. Yeah, no, it's huge. And that's, that's a big piece of our, of our success mm -hmm. is that we don't have those long wait times. So we're able to get folks in and out. We're able to provide the services and get you back on your feet and get you back out and into your routine. Absolutely. As quickly as possible. Right. What everybody sure. wants. Sure. Um, how are, so... Being different from a hospital ER, right. what, what else, how? Right. Well, you know, we do provide the same services mm -hmm. as a hospital. The biggest difference is the long wait times that right. we don't have. So, again, um, you don't want to go into the hospital and wait and wait and wait to see a physician. We have one ready Especially available for you. Especially if there's something wrong. Yeah, no, you know? for sure. For sure, that's Ooh, huge for us. This. I mean, we have them ready and available. Right. Typically, you walk in before your paperwork's complete. We've got the ER team ready to see you. Oh, that's, that's great. Nice. Oh, right. that's Dave huge. Mendoza from Complete Care, thank you so much. For more information or to find a location nearest you, visit completeemergencycare.com. Once again, that's completeemergencycare.com. Go ahead, visit there instead of an urgent care or a hospital ER, because guess what, Gabe says? Not a long wait time at all. Completeemergencycare.com. I've been working all week and I'm tired and I don't want to sleep and I want to have fun. Time for a good time. back to SA Live's coverage of the Cattle Drive and Western Heritage Parade. Look at the little Look horses. Look at these guys. It's the high running. stocking miniatures. Located in Lavernia, Texas, bred and trained by Robin and James Bailey. They are uh, not to exceed 38 inches in height. And look at the little one pulling up the end here. Uh, they could do everything that a big horse does. It just takes them a while to get to the parade. <laughs> it takes them a little bit more, more effort to get down Houston Street. Well, their legs are shorter. <laughs> oh, hello. Hi. Hi. There What's you up? are. Go that away. Looking for a carrot. Oh, oh, look, it's our friends. These are our friends that are on the... Uh, on the, on the miniature mule wagon, we had a chance to ride with them the other day, Mimi and Martin from San Antonio, and look at the look at the miniature mules and their little wagon. That's Tiff and Easter. Tiff is three Hi, years old, and Easter Good is two see. years old. Right. Mules are crossed between a male donkey and a miniature female horse. Mule. So we hope you have enjoyed our coverage today, and of course, we are asking you to continue to watch us uh, live online at salive.com and ksat.com. And we want to thank Complete Care for sponsoring our coverage as we kick off the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo, February 11th through the 28th. That's right. All right. Let's rodeo, San Antonio. That's good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to put this on a cow, and y'all keep watching us. We'll be back Monday at 1.